Greetings of the day dear students today we will discuss about useful microorganisms microorganisms are beneficial for us in a number of ways their uses can be divided into four categories such as commercial medicinal agricultural and environmental let's begin with first commercial uses first use Bacteria are used in making some of our popular food items such as curd and cheese. These are made by the action of bacteria on milk. Curd is formed due to a bacterium called lactobacillus. When a spoonful of curd is added to warm milk, these bacteria multiply and convert the lactose sugar present in the milk to lactic acid. This creates the acidic environment needed for casein coagulation. Casein is a protein present in the milk. This process of conversion of a sugar into an acid or an alcohol by the action of microorganisms is called fermentation. Cheese is also made using lactobacillus. Paneer that is cottage cheese involves the use of streptococcus bacteria curd and cheese manufacturers also add a substance called rennet obtained from the stomach lining of young cattle to the milk to make the process faster second bacteria act upon tough meat and make it soft this process is called tenderization of meat third yeast cells are used in baking industries for making bread for baking bread yeast along with a little sugar is mixed with flour to make dough the dough is kept in a warm place the yeast uses sugar present in the dough as food during the breakdown of sugar carbon dioxide and alcohol are formed this process is called fermentation the dough rises due to carbon dioxide When this dough is used to make bread and is baked carbon dioxide escapes from the loaf making it light and fluffy Fourth yeast is also used in day to day household food items like idli and dosa Fifth some algae like chlorella and seaweeds are used as food they are rich source of proteins and minerals sixth yeast is used for the production of alcohol wine and beer on a large scale for this yeast is added to grains like barley wheat rice and crushed fruits yeast cells grow in the absence of oxygen and convert the sugar present in the crushed fruit and grains into alcohol seventh Some bacteria are used in the production of tea, coffee, tobacco and lactic acid.